Hi, we are from at home tuition. In this video, we are going to see applications of some of the measures of the exterior angles of a polygon with few examples. Let's see our first question. How many sides does a regular polygon have if each of its interior angles is 165 degree? So, you want to find the number of sides and it's given each interior angle of, we will take the number of sides as n. So, n sided regular polygon is 165 degree. So, since it is a regular polygon, sum of each interior angle and each interior angle will be a straight line. So, each interior angle plus each exterior angle is equal to 180 degree. So, that is exterior angle plus interior angle is equal to a straight angle that is 180 degree. So, we will consider x as the each exterior angle because it is given interior angle is 165 degree. We will take x as the exterior angle. So, now we are substituting in the formula. So, the given interior angle is 165 degree plus x we have taken as exterior angle so which is equal to 180 degree. Now we are subtracting 165 degree on both the sides. So, x equal to 180 degree minus 165 degree that is 15 degree. So, x is a in exterior angle. So, now we know that each exterior angle of any regular polygon we have a formula 360 degree divided by n where n is number of sides. So, you want to find the number of sides. So, we are rewriting the formula as number of sides n equal to 360 degree divided by each exterior angle of the polygon. So, we have found out each exterior angle of the polygon as 65 degree for the given 165 degree internal angle that is interior angle. So, n equal to 360 degree divided by 15 degree. So, which is equal to 24 that is number of sides is 24. So, if each interior angle of a regular polygon measures 165 degree then the number of sides of the polygon is 24. Next question is, is it possible to have a regular polygon with measure of each exterior angle as 22 degree? So, solution given is measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon is equal to 22 degree. So, what we want to find? We want to find the number of sides. So, okay, that we can decide whether we can have, is it possible to have a regular polygon or not? So, now we know that measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon, we have the formula 360 degree divided by n, where n is number of sides. So, the number of sides of a polygon n equal to 360 degree divided by each exterior angle. So, each exterior angle equal to 22 degree is given in the question. So, 360 degree divided by 22 degree. So, if you simplify, you will get 16.36. So, if you look into the answer, it is not a whole number. So, thus the regular polygon with the measure of each exterior angle 22 degree is not possible because of this decimal answer. So, we are concluding that it is not possible to have a regular polygon with measure of each exterior angle as 22 degree. Next is second part of the first question. Can it be an interior angle of a regular polygon Y? So, it is given that regular polygon with the measure of each interior angle as 22 degree. Since each interior angle plus exterior angle, now we know that it is a straight angle. So, it is equal to 180 degree. Now, exterior angle is equal to 180 degree minus interior angle. So, now exterior angle is 180 degree minus 22 degree. 22 degree interior angle is given in our question. So, 180 degree minus 22 degree equal to 158 degree. So, that is each exterior angle. Okay. So, now we want to find the number of sides of the polygon if each interior angle measures 158 degree. Now, we know the formula measure of each exterior angle of a regular polygon is equal to 360 degree divided by n. So, where n is number of sides. Because we want to find the number of sides, we are rewriting the formula as number of sides n equal to 360 degree divided by each exterior angle. Each exterior angle we have found out from the given interior angle. So, that is 158 degrees. 
Now we are substituting that in the formula to find the number of sides of the polygon. So n equal to 360 degree divided by 158 degree. So if you simplify that you will get the answer as 2.278. So it is not a whole number. So the number of sides should be a whole number. But here we got it is not a whole number. So thus we are saying that it is not a regular polygon. So if each interior angle measures 22 degree then you will not get a regular polygon polygon. So, we are concluding that it is not possible to have a regular polygon with measure of each interior angle as 22 degrees. Next question is what is the minimum interior angle possible for a regular polygon? Why? So, now we want to find the minimum interior angle for a regular polygon. So, we know that each interior angle of a regular polygon is given by the formula n minus 2 into 180 degree divided by n. So, where n is the number of sides. Now, we are rearranging this equation interior angle of polygon equal to 1 that is n divided by n is 1 minus 2 divided by n into 180 degree. So, in our question we want to find the minimum interior angle. So, for interior angle to be minimum, we should have 1 minus 2 divided by n should also be minimum. Now, let us find for what value of n, 1 minus 2 by n is a minimum for a regular polygon. Now we are forming a table for number of sides n and the value 1 minus 2 divided by n each interior angle that is 1 minus 2 divided by n into 180 degree. So now you know that's given as a polygon. So we will start with a triangle that is a three sided polygon. So if n is 3 then 1 minus 2 by n is 1 divided by 3. So if you find the interior angle, each interior angle, you will get 60 degree. Suppose if you have a four-sided regular polygon, so n is 4, if you put in this value, you will get 1 by 2. So each interior angle there will be 90 degrees. So if you go for a five-sided figure, that is a regular pentagon, you will get the each interior angle is 108 degree. And if it is a six-sided figure, that is hexagon, each interior angle will be 120 degree. So, now from the table we can conclude that if the number of sides increases, each interior angle also increasing. So, therefore, in our question we want to find minimum interior angle possible. So, the minimum interior angle is only for the number of sides 3. So, thus we are concluding that the minimum interior angle possible for a regular polygon is 60 degrees because triangle is the polygon with minimum number of sides 3. Next question is what is the maximum exterior angle possible for a regular polygon? So we know that each exterior angle of a regular polygon is given by the formula 360 degree divided by n. So where n is number of sides. So for exterior angle to be maximum 1 by n should be minimum because it is inversely proportional. Now let us find for what value of n 1 by n is minimum for a regular polygon polygon. So, we are going to form the same table number of sides n and the value of 1 by n and we are going to find the each exterior angle. So, we will start with the polygon with 3 sides that is n equal to 3. If you substitute in the formula you will get 120 degree. If the number of sides is 4 you will get 90 degree angle. Number of sides is 5 you will get 72 degree angle. Number of sides is 6 you will get 60 degree angle. So, now from the table we are concluding that if the number of sides increases, each exterior angle decreases. Therefore, maximum interior angle possible for a regular polygon is 120 degree because the triangle is the polygon with minimum number of sides 3. Hope you have understood all the questions well. Thank you for watching the video.